And welcome back. This is Baller Scooper with an episode of Let's Play Xeno Gears. I'm joined as always by Fei Vong Wong, Ali Al Haim Van Houten, and Bart Bartholomew Fatima. We are still on board the Yggdrasil, but we need to head out. So let's go ahead and do that. Le yes, launch the Yggdrasil. We need to head for Thames because that they said Thames like ten times in that last little cutscene. Do you guys remember how to get there? It is this way. So let's go. I believe it's just right there. Yeah. Well, well, nothing travel distance. Bam! I rammed it, but it doesn't seem to mind. So let's just. Uh, well, somehow we ended up underneath, which is awesome, and we didn't even need to watch the docking procedures, which is even more awesome because those things are tedious and long and unimportant, really. This drunk guy's still here. I feel sick. Don't spin it! Don't spin it! Uh, I'm spinning it. Let's go to the bridge! Ugh. Freaking drunk, man. He's get off his ass and do something for once. It's time to talk to this guy. Oh, I love this guy. Do your spinny thingy. You, come on, you know what I'm talking about. What's wrong? What do you need? Hans, does that sound familiar? It's Sargasso Point. What? The Sargasso? Sargasso? What's that? It's a cave formed from microbes over many years. It's supposed to have hidden treasure, but no one has ever returned from there. The story is that the cave itself is alive. Are you going to the Sargasso? It looks like it. Your gears can't dive that deep. If they did, you would not be able to move. It could be underwater gear here. Then take your ship as far as you can and dive in with your gear. I'll go wake those winos up right now. You s it was a it's a beer hall. How can they be winos? Whatever. Really? It's okay with you? Thanks for always helping us out, Captain. Come on, do your spinny thing. Don't mention it. Damn it, he didn't do it. Come on. You're helping us because you're. <sighs> Come on. We're. Oh, fake in before it. Oh, why is Faye a dick? I think he's got it. Take care then. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you how to operate them underwater. It's easy. You can jump in the water without your feet touching the ground. Keep jumping to build up speed. You can swim pretty well in the gear, but there may be places that you can't get past if you don't do it well. Awesome. Water level. Uh, new booty! Sweet! There's new booty for sale in the supply entrance for our gear. So let's take a look. Where's the button? There's the button-ish. There we go. Supply entrance. Let us go find this place and see what they got. Maybe they've got some upgrades. Maybe they've got something comparable with uh, 17 or, or Andvari. I forgot where the gear shop was. I think it was this... I think it was this dude. Yes, it is this dude. Alright, what's he got? Engine! He does have new stuff, so I think I'm gonna be doing this for everybody. I think I have enough gold for it. Yeah! Pretty much everybody gets an upgrade. Doesn't look like the... Huh. Thir it doesn't look like 17 or... Huh. Okay, but... Everything else. So it just goes down the line, but not 17, and of course, not, not, uh, Choo Choo, because Choo Choo doesn't get upgrades ever. So let me go ahead and put, well, at least the, uh, the engine and frame on everybody. Be right back. Alright, looks like everybody is tuned up all the way. Let's see what new weapons they do have. They do have a Chaos Rod G, which is definitely an upgrade, and then a Match Lock. Which sounds like an upgrade, so I'm going to go ahead and get that for Billy. Even though I don't really know what it does. I'll get three of these X's. And then three of those. And I guess two of each of these, since I don't really know what they do. But why not? Why not? Why not waste my money needlessly? Do I have anything in here? Nothing. Nothing all that great. I don't think we've seen the motion guard before. We have seen everything else, though, I believe. Yeah. Oh, fuel leaks. 
We'll, we'll get there. Hopefully we won't, but we will. We will. Come again! Yes! We are done here! Actually, no, I need to equip the, uh, the Chaos Rod, because I might forget later on. Yeah, everything else is down, but... Plus 15! Awesome! Um, I think... Yeah, I think that's the setup I want to keep for now. Wait. Damn compass is in the way of my door! Oh, okay, seriously. Camera angles here need to be fixed a little bit. Let's just go back to the dock, and we can head on board the Thames. Er, not on board the Thames, we can get off the Thames and on board the Yggdrasil! That is what we wanted to do. We don't want to get back on board the Thames, we're done here. You can play Speed, once again, the little card game. Um, if you didn't do that already, thank God Joe is no longer on my ship. Damn, Joe. Just, really, you couldn't jump in? Ugh. Alright, with this setup, I do want to save before we head out, so let me do that off screen real fast. Alright, save down! Let's move on! Let's talk to this dude. Let's talk to Sig and head to Sargasso. It just automatically goes. Once you're docked at the Thames, you really have no choice but to, to do what you can here and then head off to Sargasso. You don't, yeah, you don't get to choose. You're like, hold on, wait, I need to level up some more now. They're like, it's a gear dungeon. If you don't have enough money, you shouldn't have come here. Whatever. Luckily, I did have enough money. And some to spare. Which is nice. We'll see how long that lasts. So, where are we? There we are. Oh, super water dungeon. So, okay. Pressing triangle. Swims. Yeah. If you want to head back to the Yggdrasil, it is this way. Uh, holding down circle makes you go twice the speed, just like everything else. And uh, we've seen the death size before, but now that they're underwater, they actually do hit us, which kind of sucks. Swim! Just blast right on through. Hold down circle, press triangle, and just motor your way through this place. Do we have a new enemy this time? No. No, we don't. So, yeah, Metasoids. Um, I think this is actually... Yeah, it is. It's a little fork in the road. We want to go this way. There's nothing up the other way. Yeah, this place... They, they don't let you change the camera angles, but the, the camera isn't always in the best location. Uh, so, yeah, I can't change the camera at all. Please show me a new enemy! No, it's this guy again! But he actually... Um, let's see, is he going to hit somebody? If he does, I want to show you how much damage he does now. Because it is a lot more than he used to. Yeah, look at that! Alright, let's keep going. Yeah, these things... Oh, snap, there's a fork in the road! Uh, I think I want to go this way? I'm not sure, though. I'm not sure about this one. No, I think I went the wrong way, damn it! What am I doing? I want to go to the right. Ugh. I always get confused because of the camera angles. But in this one, there is none. But still, still I get confused. So let's head this way. And I think this is going to take me to a save point. I think there's a save point here. Yes, yes there is. And back here, we do find a treasure chest with... Mm, Mermaid mail? What the hell is mermaid mail? Is it better than the battle apron? Well, is it better than the dervish dress too? Hell yeah it is! And I assume that only women can wear it, otherwise it'd be a merman way. Yeah, whatever. So we'll, we'll go ahead and put that on, on Ellie. Because she's probably our best <sighs> fuzzy frock. No, nobody else must wear the fuzzy frock. Okay, I do want to save, so I'll be right back. Alright, let's head back out. And hopefully I can motor my way towards the screen. Which is very awkward. But we need to go this way, the way I originally went. There we go. Now, leave 
the upcoming yeah this is the part with the jet stream and it makes swimming very difficult so uh damn you jet stream so let's see uh if i can actually make it i want to go left let me go left i can't mash the buttons any faster let me go left i think you have to go left i don't think you really have a choice I think you need to go up here, but there is treasure up here that I want to get anyway, so we're just killing two birds with one stone at this point. Come on, let's go. Ugh, even in Xenogear is water level, man. Water levels. Okay. So in here we get an empty treasure box. I heard a sound somewhere. And a dark rod, which is probably for Ellie, but on her person. Yeah, there we go. And we want to get the dark rod on her. Gonna go ahead and skip. I think it was the dynamite rod. And right, let's head back in. And see what this has done for us. It's given us another fight! Oh, finally! New enemies! I think these are new enemies. They look awfully new. They're all shiny. I don't know their names, but I want to focus my attacks on one for now. Thank you very much. Still not dead. You must die. It's a merman! Wait, seriously? Ah, uh, okay, whatever. It's a merman. Why not? Holy crap! That's a lot of damage. Missile attack! Right in the face! Holy crap! I am going to have to get a frame HP repair on him eventually. That is not cool. Alright, hard smash should be able to finish this guy off. And down he goes. Electric attack! Yeah, go for him. He's my weak he's my strongest one at this point. Um I think I need to get up to level two. I don't have a, a way around that. Spark wave! Go! Do your massive amount of damage. 2373 is for the win! Maybe this guy gets one more shot. Oh, he wastes his turn just staring blankly at Ellie's hotness or something. Um, I think she still needs to charge. Yeah, I had to use a frame HP on her. Alright, Ryuten! Simply because that was the last time we saw Ryuten. Down he goes. Three mermen down. Now the merwomen are all for me. All the mermaids. Merwomen. What the hell am I talking about? talking about the older ones, the mermilfs, you know? Those are the ones I'm really after. The mermaids, you can find those anywhere. But, yeah. Let's head! Alright, we've got to be close, right? There it is, finally. And, uh, oh, apparently we grew seaweed all over the place. Awesome, so let's go ahead and fly through that shit. That looks disgusting. And out oh, we're sucked in! It looks like it was just Faye though, that's kinda scary. No, we all made it. Okay, sweet. I don't know what sucked us in, but we're there now. We're there. And in here we do find a death blower too, which I will equip on I think I just wanna upgrade uh, the Anvari. Enables level one, and this enables one and two, or just two? I don't remember, so I'm going to try it. Okay. So now we have a door. Doors are never good. Hold on for one second. <laughs> 